What's good guys, welcome back to another episode of GNG News. So Norway cruise ship evacuated after engine problems. About 1,300 people are being evacuated from a cruise ship off the western coast of Norway. Authorities have said helicopters airlifted passengers amid high winds and treacherous waves. Police in the county of Morog Romsdale say the ship has suffered engine problems and all those aboard are being taken to shore. Norway's Sea Rescue Agency said that MV Viking Sky sent out a distress signal amid high waves and strong winds. Five helicopters and several ships are taking part in the evacuation, the agency said. However, a freighter Hagland captain also lost engine power and two helicopters were diverted to rescue its crew. There are more, fro there are more photos of the freighter on social media. News of a cruise ship suffering engine problems first came through at about 2 p.m. local time or 1 p.m. GMT. Reports suggest the ship has since managed to restart one engine and move slightly further from the coast as the evacuation continues. And in a quote, we were having lunch when the ship began to shake. John Curry, who was evacuated by helicopter, told public broadcaster NRK, Window panes were broken and water came in. It was just chaos. The trip on the helicopter, I would rather forget. It was not fun, he said. Jeanette Jacob, who was also rescued, told the channel she had never seen anything so frightening. I started to pray. I prayed for the safety of everyone on board. And she said the helicopter trip was terrifying. So the MV Viking Sky was heading to Stavanger from Tromso. Fisherman Jan Eric Fiskertrack, whose boat was one of the first to come to help the MV Viking, said, Today, after posting newspaper, it was just minutes before this could have gone really wrong. The ship could have hit the rocks if they had not started the engine and fastened the oika. By 10.40 p.m., 155 people had been brought to shore, but police warned that the figures would vary and said they would wait for countings until further notice. Eight people suffered injuries and three of those were thought to be in serious conditions. NRK reported, according to NRK, most of the passengers were British and American. Sea Rescue Services said the ship was being held steady and the evacuation was going on. The Norwegian Metro... Meteorological Institute says some waves are more than 10 meters high, with one local newspaper reporting lifeboats were forced to turn back en route to the ship due to the brutal conditions. Those brought ashore are being taken to a local sports complex. One volunteer said about 80 had arrived so far and accommodation had been found for them in local hotels. Those evacuated were taken to a local nearby sports hall, MV Viking Sky is a Viking Ocean cruise ship which has its maiden voyage in 2017. The website Marine Traffic shows the vessel was en route to Stavanger from Tromso and is drifting off the town of Farsted near Mould on the country's western coast. The area is known as the Hustervika and is reportedly one of the most dangerous stretches of the Norwegian coast. So, hopefully everybody gets out safe and sound. Thank you for watching another episode of GMG News. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on them post notifications if you haven't done already. Like this video if you think it deserves a like, share with your friends if you haven't heard about this before. And leave a comment in the comment section down below if there's anything you want me to do in the next episode of GMG News. And I will be back very shortly.